Hello everyone. In this session, we are going to learn how to make 3D model of crosshead, and its 2D drawing. After completing this session, you can able to create crosshead and generate its output in 15 minutes. Before starting design, create a new folder for the model. For this model, start creating sketch inside view plane. Draw a circle of 220 mm. Draw a center rectangle having dimension of 230 mm into 80 mm. Using trim comment, trim the unwanted sketch. Extrude this profile in symmetric direction having whole length of 100 mm. Extrude this face into 35 mm, operation as new body. Extrude this face into 35 mm, operation as new body. Isolate this body. Construct a offset plane, to the top view plane. Having a distance of minus 195 mm. Create sketch in that plane. Draw a center rectangle having dimension as, 115 mm and, 210 mm and another having 60 mm and 100 mm. Extrude this profile into 110 mm and operation as join. Make the sketch visible. Extrude this profile for 30 mm. Hide the sketch. Unisolate this body. Create sketch in this plane. Draw a circle of 80 mm. And make the distance between these two points as 10 mm. Draw two lines tangent to the circle, like this. Connect these two lines. Draw a rectangle of 45 mm into 8 mm. Make midpoint constraints to these two lines. Extrude cut these profiles, throughout the body. Isolate this body. Make this sketch visible. Extrude this profile for minus 80 mm, operation as join. Hide the sketch. Unisolate this body. Make fillets to this edges. Having cord length radius of 30 mm. Create sketch in this plane. Draw a circle of 30 mm. And 45 mm. Draw the same dimension circle here. Make the distance between this two point as 75 mm, and between this two circle as 150 mm. Draw a circle of 60 mm.
extrude cut this profile throughout the body. Make the sketch visible. Extrude this profile for 75 mm. Extrude this profile for minus 210 mm, operation as new body. Isolate this body. Make the sketch visible. Extrude these profile for 20 mm. Using thread tool, create thread to this bolt, as modeled, not to the full length, as the length of 50 mm. Unisolate this body. Hide the sketch. Create sketch in this face. Draw a circle of 30 mm. And a hexagon of radius 30 mm. Extrude this profile for 35 mm. Operation as new body. Create sketch in front plane. To create fillets to the nut. Draw a line like this. Make coincident constraint to this point and the line. Make the distance between this two point as 4.7 mm. And same 4.7 mm distance to these two points. Using Revolve Extrude, select the profile, and axis and create extrude cut. Isolate this body. Create thread to the nut as modeled. Unisolate this body. Using mirror tool, create copy of the bolt and nut bodies to the done side. Create sketch in this face. Using project comment, project this body. Hide all the bodies. Create offset sketch to these lines, as offset length of minus 8 mm. Draw a line connecting these two points. Draw a 8 mm line. 96 mm line and 8 mm line. Draw a circle of 65 mm. Extrude this sketch for minus 80 mm. As the body is hidden, extruded part is not visible, make the bodies visible. Isolate this body. Make this sketch visible. Extrude these profile into 12.5 mm. Extrude the same sketch. Having offset distance of minus 80 mm. Extrude into minus 12.5 mm. Hide the sketch. Unisolate this body. Rename all the bodies as per their component name.
convert all the bodies into component. Go to Modify, Physical Material, and change the physical material of the components as required. Save this file in the respective folder. To create 2D diagram of this model, click Design, Select Diagram, from Design. Paste the diagram, and we can change the scale, views, types. Using projected view, we can project the required views. We can also change the appearance of the projected views. We can generate bill of materials details automatically by single click in table option. And can edit the column by doubt clicking it. We can move the table. We can edit the name table, by doubt clicking it. Save the diagram in the respective folder. We can generate this diagram into PDF file, followed by this step. Thank you.